I hope uh, I hope this will be an opportunity uh, an opportunity to reconnect with my family. I miss them very much. I my brothers are at war with uh, with the Ethiopian and the Eritrean government. Uh, I don't know where they are. It's been two years. I don't know where my father is. I don't know where the other other family family members, my workmates, where my friends are. Uh, I haven't heard from them for two years because there is no telephone, no no any means of communication. Uh, so I miss them and I, I don't know if they are even alive. This agreement and many analysts are saying that um, it needs to be coordinated, it needs to be systematic, and above all, it needs to be sequenced. Sequenced so that the Tigrayans are not left uh, uh, at their devices after handing in all the weapons, then suddenly they are attacked uh, by, by the center. This has happened in many other countries, and this is something to watch, that trust is fast built um, even as the disarmament uh, is called by the agreement is actually initiated. They will be need for um, for, for healing. There will be need for some kind of uh, truth, justice and reconciliation commission in Ethiopia to address some of these um, horrendous human rights abuses that have taken place, uh, perhaps carried out by both sides um, that, are, that are fighting. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.